Just yeah. say when. Go. Uh, my name is Hank Rogers. Um, my mission number one is to end the use of carbon-based fuel. And why is that? It's a lot of bad things have been happening because we produce too much carbon dioxide. Global warming, economic disasters, this and that and the other thing. So I'm really interested in finding other ways to, <clears throat> especially for Hawaii, to generate electricity, uh, to move vehicles around. And uh, so for me, uh, I'm taking my ranch, uh, Puawa Ranch, off the grid completely. We are solar, as you can see. Uh, and the solar panels that, that you see behind me are enough to power the entire ranch, uh, store using something called a flow battery, uh, enough power so that we have uh, electricity when it's dark and still have electricity left over. So what are we gonna do with the excess electricity? Uh, here's, the, here's the deal. The Big Island is just a little bit too big for electric vehicles. And why is that? It's because my electric car has a range of 240 miles, means if I go from here, Kona side, to Hilo, and try to come back, I would need to stay in Hilo for um, overnight to uh, charge my car, and that's not how people use cars. So the answer to that is to have hydrogen, because the hydrogen, I can go to Hilo, and I can fill up with hydrogen, and have enough, enough to come back. And hydrogen can be produ produced by geothermal, it can be produced by solar, or by wind, or by OTEC, or by any kind of alternative technology. And when I say alternative te technology, I'm talking about s technology that takes free energy from our environment here in Hawaii and turns it into something that we can use as a fuel. And hydrogen is really the ideal fuel because you can use anything to make hydrogen. And when you use hydrogen, at the end of the day, you combine hydrogen you com with oxygen, you get electricity, and what do you release? H2O. That's water. That is benign. So if a little bit of water comes out of my tailpipe, that's good. There's no problem with that. Carbon dioxide is a problem. Carbon monoxide is a problem. But H2O, not a problem. So I'm a big fan of hydrogen, and I'm, I'm looking to become part of the hydrogen economy. I want to have hydrogen vehicles. I want to find alternative ways of making hydrogen here in Hawaii and be part of the solution. Thank you. Can you also then... So this is my, uh, my photovoltaic array. We have probably 80, almost 90 uh, kilowatts of PV on the roof of, this, of my workshop. Um, it is probably, well, the most, one of the, one of the best ways for a residence to get electricity that is not from the electric company. The electric company uses oil to make, to make electricity. That doesn't make any sense. We are paying 40, maybe up to 50 cents per kilowatt hour. That's crazy. Um, Idaho is three cents per, uh, per kilowatt hour. Why? It's because they get it from renewable resources. They get it from, uh, from hydro in their case. But we have all kinds of, uh, of alternative energy in Hawaii. We're the southernmost state in this country. And so we have the best sun in this country. So that is a way for us to capture the power of the sun.